Oscar De La Hoya will file a lawsuit against Ryan Garcia if Ryan Garcia pursues his exhibition fight in Japan without including Oscar De La Hoya and Golden Boy promotions. During his Thanksgiving edition of Clapback Thursday, the Golden Boy did not go around the bush and made it perfectly clear that he owns all the rights to Ryan Garcia's fights. And based on his statement, it seems like this also includes non-professional sanctioned fights. Oscar De La Hoya said that if Ryan Garcia pursues to go on with this fight without including Golden Boy promotions, then he'll have no choice but to sue Ryan Garcia for not honoring his contractual obligations. De La Hoya clarified that he's not stopping Ryan Garcia from fighting. He also said that he does want Ryan Garcia to fight and make money. However, this is a matter of making sure that Ryan Garcia also honors his contract. Because again, according to Oscar De La Hoya, he owns the global rights to all of Ryan Garcia's fights. Now, as far as everybody involved from the Japanese side of business, this fight will still happen. Rising Fighting Federation, the Japanese combat sports organization, as well as Fanmio, who is distributing and is in charge of the pay-per-view, are not switching gears and continue to promote this event. The Japanese media also doesn't seem to care, with most national news outlets continuing to say that this event will definitely happen. Now the thing is, as far as they're concerned, the negotiations made by Ryan Garcia with everyone in Japan is already a done deal. Now if Ryan Garcia and Golden Boy Promotions have issues, then that's their own problem. And that is solely between Ryan Garcia and Oscar De La Hoya. So what's the solution here? Well, don't take my word for it, but it looks like Ryan Garcia has no choice but to include Oscar De La Hoya and Golden Boy in this fight and give them a cut of whatever money he's making from fighting abroad. The thing is, if he doesn't include Golden Boy, then he ends up violating his contract and will have to face a lawsuit when he returns from Japan. If he however backs out, he then ends up ruining his relationship with Rising Fighting Federation and may also get in trouble with the people he negotiated with in Japan. Oscar De La Hoya also threw jabs at the fans saying that he is preventing Ryan Garcia from fighting. He said that these people are being dumb and that this whole thing about Ryan Garcia is a matter of his contractual obligations that he is legally binded to. In the same episode of Clapback Thursday, De La Hoya also threw jabs at Eddie Hearn for allegedly having an affair with Sky Nicholson. Although personally, I would rather not get into that just because that is something that doesn't really concern the main narrative of this video. But yeah guys, so far, that is what's up with this current situation. What are your thoughts about this? Definitely let me know in the comment section. Thank you so much for watching, and as always, please don't forget to click that like and subscribe button for more quick talks.